Hey friends, welcome back to Laconian Concepts. We're headed up I-90 and we're gonna go for a day hike up in the mountains. Uh, it's after work, so we might be chasing daylight a little bit, but uh, just wanna bring you along for the ride and hope we have a good time. So, all right, we'll see you in a bit. So we made a quick detour to Mountain High Burgers. Uh, you might even say that this whole hike relied on coming here. Um, so you got the what burger? Rainier, Mount Rainier burger. Mount Rainier burger. What's on that? Uh, double uh, double patties, double bacon, double cheese. Nice. I got the Mount Stewart double patty. I don't even remember what's on there. I think barbecue sauce and Thousand Island. And then of course we got some fries too. So we're gonna chow on this and then hit the trail. But uh, I wanna give a special shout since it's a burger episode. He carves outdoors, go check him out. And then, uh, yeah man, if you're ever up this way, you should check this place out. It's right up by, is this Easton? Yeah. So, cool place, I like it. Burgers are good. All right, we'll catch up with you in a bit. All right. Yeah. Last bite. Big one too. What do you think, Mark? Heck yeah. It's a good. Oh my gosh. Yeah, bro. Words can't. I can't put it into words. Words just words really can't. This. No words. Hi. <laughs> Cheers. Let's go. All right, so we're on the trail now. What's this called? Amabilis. So it's just off I-90. We literally had to walk over I-90 from the parking lot for the trailhead. And now we're immediately in snow. Which takes a lot more energy than <laughs> I thought it was going to. Gonna burn that burger off, Marvin. Oh yeah. Bring that beer. <laughs> Milk was a bad choice. <laughs> But I think this is the actual trailhead right here. So, up we go. All of a sudden, the sky got kind of gloomy, too. So we're at a crossroads. Man, it is foggy. It's kind of cool. See you at the crossroads. Oh, dude, I love that song, man. 
All right, don't fall in, Marvin. <laughs> Cheers to post holes. Mm -hmm. Buddy's off uh, Georgetown. I thought it was April, but all of a sudden it looks like January or December or something. Welcome back, winter. It is full on snowing. And we both uh, are two beers, so in a pretty good mood, let's put it that way. <laughs> I think it's cold, I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, this is, this is a winter hike. This is not a spring hike, which I kind of like it that way. Except for you, uh, if you stop for too long, then, uh, then you get kind of cold. But other than that, I like it a lot, so. Yeah, we're just gonna keep trucking. Snow in the base. There it is. Not right near. Yeah, there's the, the view. Oh, and there, there's St. Helens. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can see Baker. Yeah, I see it all. Hey, you remember when we were like, we don't need snowshoes? Do you remember that, Marvin? No, I don't remember that. Okay, I don't either. Didn't you leave your snowshoes at home? I think I don't find at home. Pretty sure they're at home. We're about... Looks like we're about a mile from the top. This is a pretty good spot, you know? I think this is a... This, this screams coffee to me, right here. In fact, with the... Uh, Onset of snow in this small building that's probably locked, but we can at least block the wind out. Send me a blizzard. Don't pretend me in a blizzard. <laughs> I mean, you know. Welcome to Edgar. Oh, sweet. Bro. <laughs> this just got amazing. <laughs> yeah. The hut is open. Don't fall in there, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where are the hut? Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. I can't see it. Oh, it's actually locked. Are you? It says the hut is open. But it's not open. Maybe it's frozen. Yeah, just... Yeah! Oh, and there's a heater, bro. There's a heater! Oh, yeah! And then you can just take some of these skis off. And we'll yeah, we'll just, right we'll just ski down. <laughs> Everything's so generous here. Look at this, man. Stove? There's already a... I don't even have to use my... I, I brought a stove, okay? Please be very careful with the stove and heater. Don't leave them. Dude, I'm gonna get comfortable for a minute. I hope you don't mind if I just, like, relax here. Just take take a load off, Marvin. <laughs> it's like, look at this. Look at this. It's incredible. It is coming down. What did it cost? A Mountain High Burger? Totally worth it. <laughs> like, this is incredible. Oh. Shit off of this. Okay. I think you can go like yeah, this. that's what I think that's what it's for. Maybe. Look at that. Dude, you're a genius. Okay. All right, we're gonna get set up. <laughs> make some coffee. I'm gonna get comfy. All right, bring you back. All right, so we're getting set up here, and I noticed there's a little like log that the you like sign in and <laughs> check out the century. Sean Harvey, Seattle, four nineteen twenty two. Uh, from TH in about two hours. No one here, so I strip naked. Socked my snow. <laughs> uh, finally, a nice, nice to get out of the wind. Really appreciate all the work that went into making the hut a reality. This is so awesome. This is not real, man. <laughs>
Dude, I brought that smart water bottle for your coffee. Oh, I brought this for my coffee. Okay. Let's do it again. We get these moves. We get these moves. You thought about what you're going to say in the, in the journal? Yeah. Just about ready. You need a cup. <clears throat> oh, yeah. I got a cup. I mix them. I mean, you, you can do whatever them? you want, but yeah. You got, you're I mix a too? yeah. Okay. I mix a this black and then with some cream and sugar. Okay, cool. I like that. Cool. Because if you do this one by itself, it's too much. Yeah. Well, yeah, I think that. Yeah, because like black coffee is too bitter. I like something to like something to like mellow it out. Yeah. So I, like I like black like coffee, but. When I'm working hard, I don't mind a little bit. Of I put a little cream in it because I just like to uh, mellow out the like bitterness. 420. Was somebody here? Yeah. Somebody nice to get out of the wind. Really appreciate all the work that went in the. Did you write that? This hat a reality, Jim S. That's Is that funny. you, Marvin? Is that your pen name? No, that's funny. Somebody was just here. That's crazy. Somebody was just here. I didn't realize that when I was reading the diary or journal or whatever. What do you call that thing? Log, travel log. Yeah. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, told me, it was ready. Here, I gotta do it over here though. Ow, that was hot. Yeah, there you go. Okay, let me mix mine. And... Can't drink it yet, Marvin. Have to wait. My skinny ski should be interesting. What a funny guy. Okay. Get impatient, please. Cheers, bro. Yeah. Uh, cheers. That's pretty hot. It's really hot. I, <laughs> I brought just the thing. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it's hot. <laughs> you know, there's snow outside. That feels good though, man. I don't mind it being hot. This is amazing. Put an insulator on. Oh man, that's so good. Are you cooling it down? Yeah. Throw a tiny bit of uh, snow in there. See, I hate when I when I do it a little too. You, know, you gotta be subtle if you do it a little too quickly. You know, you burn yourself. You know. I just let it burn me. What'd you write? Okay. I heard so I'm in the middle of nowhere. And here's this cabin. It's pretty windy and it's snowing pretty hard, but I'm pretty sure this cabin is really here. Or maybe I'm passed out in the snow imagining a warm cabin. 
Marvin, dirty fed. <laughs> right away. F done. Okay, let's see. It's crazy. Somebody, oh, somebody drew a little picture. What a treat. Great work on the hut. Enjoying our backcountry tour, Diana. It looks like there was like kind of a gap. A few days and then somebody came yesterday and then today. This is a cool spot, man. I mean, like, I'm sure if the fog wasn't as thick, you could see what's out there. It's just funny that I didn't notice anybody comment on, like, hey, there's a hut up there. So the first entry is 225, so this is pretty new. Only a couple months. This is so cool. We did We did good. We did well. Good call, Marvin. Good call. There's a last minute change, too. What do you think? It's probably like right at like 32 degrees. 30 degrees, maybe? Usually it goes right above freezing to snow like this, the big fat flakes. You can tell they're a little wet. So it's probably like. I'm gonna guess 33 or 34. This is nice, man. I was thinking I was gonna sit outside. <laughs> it's unreal. You know what I really wanna do sometime is, uh, what's that one called? Um, three Fingers. You ever seen that? Mm -mm. You probably don't want to do it. But someday I'm going to make you do it with me. There's a ladder. There's two ladders and they're tied tied and anchored to the rocks. And they're wood ladders to get to the cabin that's on top of. There's like three fingers. And you have to like go up this ladder system to get into the cabin. But once you're in the cabin, it's like, it's like a bigger version of this. Yeah. It's like a fire lookout, but it's super sketch. Right at the ascent. Like... When you're within 50 feet of it, you're like, ah, uh, I don't want to go up there. Yeah. Like, people do it. I want to go up there. That was pretty uh, heavy for a minute there. I know, man. It was coming down right when we found this place. I think we're both dead. Huh? I think you're right. I think we're both dead. Yeah, like, it just... It just got crazy, and then, but there's a cabin, like, it's Narnia, it's Narnia, like, we went into Narnia. I didn't see the wardrobe, but I think I went in. Yeah, I mean, there was a lamppost out there, so. Yeah, there's a All right, it's been nice, but it's time to hit the trail. Farewell cabin. This is cool. Now we gotta head down. So all of a sudden, we stopped for a second, and I turned around. There it is. I don't know what it is, but there it is. You can see something, the clouds are finally breaking. Whoa, dude. Oh no, up to your knee. <laughs> oh, okay, there we go. All right, back to it. Oh, there's a lake over there. <sighs> That's Lake Easton. Oh, dude. It's gorgeous. I'll go over there. Well, we made it. The top. There's supposedly a view over here, but all of a sudden it's foggy again. So. Beautiful view, Marvin. <laughs> yeah, man. You don't want to miss this one. I'm just glad we saw 
that break in the clouds earlier. Yeah. That was cool. All right, so uh, I'm gonna crack a beer and we're gonna head down. See you soon. Cheers. There it is. Father Christmas showing up with gifts and hot cocoa. It wasn't a, a mirage, Marvin. There it is. For real. And look at this. Look at that sky. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, I got a endorphin high right now, man. It looks like Christmas. It is rapidly getting darker, but oh man, it still looks bright with all that snow. So there's still a good amount of reflection because of all the white snow, but yeah, we're chasing the clock now. And I brought a headlamp just in case, so no worries, but... All right, if you can't tell, now it's getting dark. So, just on the final descent. And uh, I'd say it was overall a really successful day. And very fun, it was a cool trail. I think if it were clear for a majority of uh, the hike, We'd had some better views. We got a couple spots that opened up, but the cabin was a huge win. So, thanks to the conservatory for that. All right, just a few short miles to go, and uh, I'll see you at the bottom. All right, well, we made it back, guys. As you can tell, it's uh, after daylight. Last little leg there turned to slush and we just were racing. But uh, yeah, that was a pretty fun trip. It was a really cool spot. I loved the cabin that was up there. And uh, I think I'm gonna have to come back here. I liked it that much, so. You know how this goes, do all the things. Hit like, subscribe if you haven't. Leave a comment down below, just say it was cool. But uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next one. All right, take it easy. Yeah, bro.